PVPers are making a fortune and let me tell you, it is insane. So if I go over here, you can scroll up and I got 150 honor, which isn't that much, but I got a blue pattern and I got a combat thing. Uh, it's a crafting reagent, which is garbage, but the pattern sells for 24,000 gold and you need a minimum of a 606 in arena, but this is a 545 item that can be upgraded, which is pretty sweet, to be honest, which is uh, not too bad. Not only that, but if you use your honor right here, I think it's 7,000, uh, you're able to, 7,500, get a pattern that is a flask, and that flask makes is just ridiculous for uh, the actual pattern. So this flask of honor, if you go to the uh, AH, I think it sells for like 100,000 or 200,000. Both of the, all these flasks, these uh, vicious flasks, they all sell for about that much. So uh, you might want to be on the lookout for those kind of flasks because they are just, uh, you might want to stay in, P what I'm saying is you might want to stay in PVP mode, have war mode on because when you are going, there'll be these warships that will be flying around the map. And every time they land, it drops off a box. And that box will give you a uh, item. I was able to, like I said, loot that war box. So it says war box supply just shows up, check your uh, map. And then I was able to grab that, get 150 honor, get the forge and get this pattern that sells for 25,000. And all I'm doing is just camping f rares right now because uh, I need the, the rep. Um, so I'm almost finished with pretty much all of them. Um, I thought I cleared, I cleared most of them, but for whatever reason, rare sp scanner is not showing up on the, um, it's not updating the ones that I have killed. Uh, I think it is now, but um, it's quite annoying. But what I was trying to say was that PvP peers, if you turn on war mode and, uh, where is this guy? Yeah, see, I, I, I need to find out who I've killed and who I haven't because this is, the, the rare guy should not be showing up, but I'll kill it. Just maybe it will clear it after this. I don't know what the bug is, but all I'm saying is keep uh, grinding the with PvP war mode on because you can get patterns that sell for uh, one 20,000, but just the honor exchange for the patterns from the uh, town sells for a lot. And I'll show you what th those are here in a second, actually. Um, let me actually, I showed you on the, the map of what they look like, but let me actually show you a town. So if I go to town and I go to where you pick these up, it's 7,500, you can do your weekly quest there. So let me go to town real quick. Oops, where is this? Yeah, it was, it was the right spot. Wasn't I? There, yeah, just wasn't, uh, wasn't phased in. So uh, what this is, is you'll go to the front of, uh, of the major city and there'll be a flattern, a pattern vendor there. Um, uh, you can, I, this is the worst. When you fly up and you have like one uh, vigor and you aren't able to go anywhere. So we're gonna go right here. There's a pattern vendor. Uh, there's also a weekly quest here for PVP. So if you haven't picked those up, you definitely wanna pick uh, the quest up over here. But the pattern vendor, I believe is right over here. And so uh, it might be on the other side. Yeah, it's on the other side. So what you want is to get this pattern. Yeah. Uh, not there. Yeah, so he, these patterns right here, this one sells for 28,000, this sells for 44,000, this sells for 26,000. So, and you need it 7,500 7, uh, honor. So, I mean, just farming all day, not too bad. Especially if you are getting those warships and getting those drops, 
you can make a pretty penny. So I'm gonna actually throw this on the auction house. And that is how PVPers, and I'm not a PVPer, I just stay in war mode, so, and farm uh, some decent gold. So I'm gonna throw that pattern on. 24,000, there's only four. Man, I could flip those, right? Maybe I'll do another video on it. We'll, we'll, we'll figure it out. Until next time, guys, remember to like and subscribe. I'm out. So these war supplies are what you kind of want to shoot for. Uh, they'll drop them here in uh, a moment. And so <clears throat> they'll be fighting them. I'll probably just grab it and run away. As far as uh, I'll show you how that works. As you can see, they're all fighting. Uh, I'm not going to fight. Let them kill each other, and then I'll just get some that gear. No, leave me alone. All right, so we're, we're just about done here. We're going to open this bad boy up. All right, we'll let them fight more until uh, they're all dead. Okay, I think we're just about there. Now we can get this. All right, we want it, so get this decent gear. Or decent loot so 150 and then that field sometimes you'll get obviously uh, more of the patterns but that's essentially what you do i'm i just essentially do it while i'm waiting on rares and that's about it so uh easy way to get some decent stuff uh and ultimately yeah get some free things and money in the in the meantime while you're rare farming or while you're being lazy, whatever that is for you. So now I just uh, sit here and wait for the next little airship, which is about, I think, once every half an hour or so. And then I just sit here and wait for uh, the different rares. So I've obviously cleared a lot of them. Uh, last seen two days, last seen two days. I just killed one here. So these are ones that, uh, and I'll just keep farming as they pop. Um, I'll probably just sit here because I haven't seen a lot of these ones in uh, quite a while. Um, and then do my other dailies. So making sure that I clear all of the different rares. Like this one, I haven't seen in nine days. Um, 17 days. So I definitely want to make sure that I'm getting all my rep uh, to maximize my, my rep. And then obviously some PVP stuff here where I can get a gear, 574, and uh, that's about it. So doing world quests and your stuff gets you uh, as well worth it.